Did you know some of your daily habits could be harming your kidneys? These two bean-shaped organs, tucked away in your lower back, are your body's unsung heroes, filtering waste and toxins from your blood. But, your kidneys are under siege. Yes, everyday habits, ones you wouldn't think twice about, could be putting these vital organs at risk. We're talking about the silent assassins of kidney health. Intrigued? You should be. Stay tuned as we unveil these harmful habits. Processed foods might be convenient, but they're not doing your kidneys any favors. These ever-present items in our pantries and fridges often have a dark side, hidden behind their alluring packaging and easy preparation. One of the major culprits is the high sodium content. Sodium, like any other mineral, is necessary for the body in moderation. However, processed foods typically contain sodium levels that far exceed the recommended daily intake. This excessive sodium intake puts a lot of pressure on your kidneys. These vital organs are responsible for filtering out excess sodium from your bloodstream. But when there is too much of it, they have to work overtime. This can lead to kidney damage over time. Additionally, the high sodium content in processed foods can lead to high blood pressure, a condition that further stresses your kidneys. So, next time you reach for a convenient meal, think of your kidneys. Opt for fresh, whole foods whenever possible to give your kidneys a well-deserved break. Water is life, especially for your kidneys. Now this isn't just a catchy phrase, it's a biological fact. Our kidneys are like the waste management system of our bodies. They filter out toxins and excess substances from our blood. But to do this effectively, they need a sufficient supply of water. When we don't drink enough water, our kidneys have to work overtime. They struggle to dilute and flush out the toxins, which can lead to dehydration. This state of dehydration puts a strain on the kidneys, causing them to wear out faster and can lead to the formation of kidney stones. These are hard deposits made of minerals and salts that form inside your kidneys. And trust me, they're not a pleasant experience. Chronic dehydration can also increase your risk of more serious kidney complications, like chronic kidney disease. So, let's make a toast to our kidneys with a glass of water. Remember, eight glasses a day keeps the kidney doctor away. Popping a pill for every ache, your kidneys might be paying the price. It's a common scenario for many people. A headache starts, or perhaps some back pain, and the first instinct is to reach for that bottle of over-the-counter painkillers. It's quick, it's convenient, and it's effective. But what many don't realize is that this habit can lead to serious kidney damage over time. Over-the-counter painkillers, especially non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, are known to cause harm to your kidneys if used excessively. The kidneys, which filter out toxins from your blood, can be overwhelmed by these drugs, leading to damage or even kidney failure in severe cases. It's not about completely abandoning these painkillers, but rather using them responsibly. Always follow the recommended dosage and consider other pain relief methods such as rest, heat, or physical therapy. Remember, pain relief is important, but so is your kidney health. Exercise isn't just about looking good, it's about feeling good too. Let's talk about why you need to stop skipping your workouts. Regular exercise is like a maintenance check for your body, ensuring all systems are running smoothly, and this includes your kidneys. When you exercise, you're helping to maintain healthy blood pressure levels. High blood pressure can cause damage to the kidneys over time, and that's something we all want to avoid. Exercise acts as a natural pressure regulator, helping to keep those numbers in check. Think about it. Your heart pumps blood, your blood carries oxygen, and your kidneys filter that blood. It's all connected. When one part isn't working as it should, the others suffer too. Exercise supports the whole system, promoting overall health and, notably, healthy kidney function. So, the next time you're tempted to skip that workout, remember your kidneys. They are working hard for you every single day, filtering and cleaning your blood. Move for your kidneys, they'll thank you for it. Smoking and drinking aren't just bad for your lungs and liver. They're also quite the culprits when it comes to kidney damage. Yes, you heard that right. Those innocent looking kidneys are not immune to the harmful effects of these habits. Let's talk about smoking first. Each puff of smoke you inhale releases a cocktail of toxins into your body. These toxins can cause your blood vessels to constrict, limiting the blood flow to your kidneys. 
Over time, this can lead to kidney damage and even kidney failure. As for excessive drinking, it puts immense pressure on your kidneys to filter out the harmful substances from the alcohol. The more you drink, the harder your kidneys have to work. Over time, this can lead to chronic kidney disease. So the next time you reach for that cigarette or that extra glass of wine, remember, your kidneys are silently bearing the brunt of these choices. Your kidneys deserve better. Your health is in your hands, and now you know better. It's time to take a quick recap of the five habits we've just discussed that can wreak havoc on your kidneys. Firstly, we talked about the overconsumption of processed foods. These are often high in sodium, phosphorus, and other additives that can strain your kidneys. Try to opt for fresh, whole foods whenever possible. Next up was the importance of staying hydrated. Not drinking enough water can lead to kidney stones and other complications. So, remember to keep your water bottle handy and sip throughout the day. We also discussed the excessive use of painkillers. Overuse of these can cause kidney damage, so always use them as directed by a healthcare professional. Skipping regular exercise was our fourth bad habit. Regular physical activity helps regulate blood pressure, which in turn aids in maintaining kidney health. So, incorporate some form of exercise into your daily routine. Lastly, we highlighted the dangers of smoking and excessive drinking. Both these habits can lead to kidney disease amongst other health issues. If you're struggling to quit, seek help. There are numerous resources available to guide you on this journey. Now that we've recapped, it's time to take action. Remember, adopting healthier habits can significantly improve your kidney health. Knowledge is power, but it's what you do with that knowledge that truly matters. So start today, make that change, and let's journey towards better health together. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Your kidneys will thank you.